Hi, Vogue. Vogue. We're, We're the Backstreet Boys, Boys, and this is what's in our bag. Ready? I'm going first. Da, 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 gonna read something, and what is this? <laughs> I know who's that. Oh my is. gosh, I bet you guess. this is Howie's. Ding, 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 ding. All oh. right. This is essential for Howie to look this beautiful every day. <laughs> <laughs> Who takes the longest to get ready? I gotta say Kevin. Kevin. Mostly Mr. because I'm sleeping until the last minute. <laughs> then I hurry up and get dressed. We yeah. almost miss the uh, starting of our show time because of him a lot of times. So I'm just letting you know. That's so, Nick's. House is dust. <laughs> this is my little panda. I would use it back home because my wife actually stays up like late, like Kevin, and then I go to bed early because I'm the one that wakes up with the kids. So this is essential while she's watching Netflix and I'm trying to get to sleep <laughs> with some you know, this and some earplugs. So I brought her on the road because it makes me happy, my little panda. And, oh. it, and it helps me to sleep out here. Yes. Okay, what's in the bag? Well, what's I grabbed... This bad boy. You would think it would be mine, since I also love baseball caps, but I know this is yours. Uh, yes. You this live in this mine. thing. Yes. Literally, day in and day out. It's a show cap that I wear in the show. It's my favorite. I don't want to lose it. I've had a couple of my stage hats stolen. Look at the actually. sweat stains in this thing. Woo! We've been to Germany a lot. Plenty a lot. of times. <laughs> a yeah. lot. So what is our favorite words that we like, that we know throughout the years? Prost. <laughs> Cheers. Toast. Because I like the German beers and it's always good to toast with it. I like, uh, I like Lieben. Uh, I like Kusen. Uh, That's a kiss, dude. Photo machen bitte, photo machen bitte. So they want a picture with us. So That's something that I always have in my brain. Mine is Scheiße. <laughs> I just love the way it rolls off the tongue. It does. It's, 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 it's a, a good fun one. word to say. <laughs> Scheiße. All right, let's go. Who's this? Oh, that's Howie's. Oh, that's Howie's. We know that. What is that? Oh, no, that's his vitamins. His vitamins. His vitamins. I do a lot of vitamins every day. You got to make sure you're, you know, treating your body right out here. I have some Juice Plus in there. I guess make sure I get my, my juices and my it's vegetables. Ginkgo biloba. No, I don't have ginkgo biloba because I know that doesn't work anymore. And this is a little thing that I carry my vitamins in. Whoa. Chapstick? Chapstick. Right. That's you. It's mine. No. Oh, okay. now, Kevin. This might look wow. like an ordinary chapstick, but this is very sentimental. It has superpowers. Well, it does have superpowers because uh, my mother recently passed away, and she held this in her hands ah. in the hospital. It gave, gave her comfort, and so I keep it with me. Nice. That's awesome. awesome. That's beautiful. That is awesome. Bro. That's beautiful. Awesome. Hey, what's oh, this? Oh, yeah. I'm missing something. Can you this was a wedding ring in a bag. This is my tour wedding ring. My actual wedding ring stays at home because my actual wedding ring wraps all the way around with the diamonds. Unfortunately, I was losing stones. This is my tour version, so I can hold the mic and not lose any more stones. Back in the day, I never thought I would ever get married. I never thought I would settle down. I never thought I would have a family. I thought I would be the one guy in the group still single and. It is the best thing I've ever done. Having a family, having an amazing wife, she is my rock. She holds it down, all of our wives. Without them, we would all fall apart. They are the hardest working Literally. <laughs> people in our world. So, yes, this is my, can't leave home without it. My wife actually, and my kids, uh, just recently for my birthday, gave me this ring. It has my two uh, birthstones of my two boys. It's something new that I'm now carrying around with me and cherish. It's beautiful. Thank you. Gorgeous. Noise. If you could carry one place in your bag with you everywhere around the world, what would it be? For, for me, I'm gonna have to say it's on the beach. It's where I feel the smallest, looking at the ocean and the sunrise and the sunset. I think about being in the park with my kids. For me, uh, I would have to say the Beverly Hills Hotel. Uh, that's where I got married. That's where you got married. That's where my life changed forever. I'd have to <laughs> say on the water with my family. Like to go uh, wake surfing and wakeboarding with my wife and my kids. Any chance that we get, we're on the water. I think during COVID, one of the blessings that came out of it for me was to be able to slow down and uh, to appreciate a lot of things that I, I felt like I had probably taken for granted in the past. And so having a nice glass of wine, playing a little bit of uh, yacht rock, uh, light 70s rock music, and just watching the sunset go down, it would take me to my happy place. Did you just call it yeah. yacht rock? 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I've never heard that. It's a whole playlist. I've never heard it. Yeah, right, right. Yeah, right. It's a whole oh, genre. And I just go off, I drift off into the yacht rock. Okay. No. That's Nick. That's Nick's. Oculus, That's baby. Nicholas. A funny story, we used to travel with like computers that we had in these road cases, and we would do gaming against each other, and, or we would always have like the uh, Nintendo 64s or the PlayStation. We always would have competitions. So as technology has gotten a lot uh, better over the years and more, you know, compact. This is uh, just basically an essential for me because I, I could be in my hotel room and just go anywhere you want. So that's the beauty about the metaverse, and it's just so much fun to play, and it and it helps you kind of get out when you can. And we've right. lost Nick now. All right, Nick, you have to with your Nick. Oculus reach in the back. Nick, you have to. Oh, run. I gotta do. It's okay. Okay. Your turn to reach in the back. Probably messed my hair up. Yeah. Oh yeah, you too. Oh yeah. That's all all right. right. Oh yeah, it's all screwed up. Okay, let's go. All right, I guess I'm just going right for the. Oh, whose is this? That's mine. That okay. is Kevin. Actually, one of these is Brian's, oh. and one of these is mine. Let's check that out. That's Brian's. Well, this is a two-for-one deal. Well, I grew up singing in church as a little boy. My faith has always been very important to me. What was given to me by my wife. I love jewelry, but I love what this represents for me growing up. This is a miniature, like, dog tag that a dear friend of mine gave to me. This is when my first son was born and it has his name, Mason Frey Richardson, and his birth date on it. And I take it all over the world with me everywhere I go. Oh! Well, whose is this? What? Santa Claus. That's you? Santa, Santa Claus? Claus. <laughs> so yeah, this is our very first away. ever in almost 30 years Christmas album. We are over the moon excited to be in the category amongst the greats that have had Christmas albums out for decades, Dean Martin, the Rat Pack, uh, Mariah Carey, Boys to Men, you name it, to be in the mix with them now is an honor. So, uh, and we made it with a lot of love. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. we hope you enjoy it. If we could carry one song in our bag, one song. What would it be? Only one of ours. It would be all I have to give. Because ah. my love is all I have to give to you, boys. You're really <laughs> loving lately. I think what? his and his and mine are the same, unless you switch it up on me right no, now. No, he always did. Are you talking about Siberia? Siberia is mine for sure. Yeah, Siberia is mine. It's mine. just you're a big perfect fan. Yeah. I thought he was going to say, as long as you love me. No. Mine would be Back to Your Heart. It's on the Millennium album, and I wrote that when I was broken up with my girlfriend, who now has been my wife my for my wife. almost 20 Three years. I guess I'm gonna say back she's bad. It's just grimy, you know, it's it's like a really edgy kind of feeling that you get from the song and I, and there's no other, other songs out there like it and I'm I'm happy to say that you know we have that in our bag. Well uh, thanks for hanging out with us backstage on tour and that's what's in the bag. Yes. Yeah. yeah. That's all that's what's in the back she's bad. Woo! Thank you. you play to win the game. That's the oh, beautiful thing about it. Yeah.